Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing well. I'm gonna pop into Dollarama and film for you. I do have some time today. So I haven't been to Dollarama again in a while and I do kind of avoid it because things are a little bit more pricier here. They range from a dollar to four dollars, but I am in search of some new paper pads that I've seen circulating around on the Facebook group. So I hope to find them and I thought I would share what I see in store today. So let's go on in. I do consider this Dollarama a much smaller scaled, so their craft department has some things, but it's not as large as some of the other ones I visit, so be prepared that this store does have more of a limited supply, especially with toys and craft items I find, it is a lot smaller. Thank you. These are similar to the ones from Dollar Tree. I'm even wondering if they're the same size. I'm gonna grab a buggy and just never know what I'm gonna find in here. And I am looking for those paper pads, so they're a little awkward to carry if I'm filming at the same time. Now these are cute if you have like a farmhouse theme, especially on a porch or a patio with flowers. Oh my gosh, they're too cute. These are really pretty as well. I'm not a big fan of the floral, but $4. You can find them at Michael's as well, but they're a lot more expensive. These are cute. You can do like that pretend rain effect with the lights or with beads hanging off your little canister for $4. Not bad at all if you want to do a cute DIY with these. Oh, these are pretty. Very nice tray. I like the color. The coral peach is really in this year. Or the coral pink. I'm not sure. I guess just coral. <laughs> these are two in a pack. The Dollar Tree has some. I think two or four in a pack. Not the same shape though. I love those square ones. These ones here are really pretty.
Look at that, these vases are the same ones you find at Dollar Tree for half the price. You can get two for the price of one here. These ones are a lot larger and heavier. But still, those top ones, wow. Really have to be careful where you do your shopping these days. This one here is like the smaller one that you find at Dollar Tree as well. These are pretty. Just like a stone or a faux cement plaster type pot. One thing I've never paid attention to is if Dollar Tree carries coffee filters. I don't think, maybe they do. You can make some really pretty wreaths with the coffee filters. This is different. They're really big and bulky. I'm not sure how your hand would move around in them. I saw some Facebook groups that they were hauling this spin broom. I'm not sure if it's great quality. However, it was advertised on TV. It's a nice little pail. It's nice and sturdy. I'm going to take a look at the cleaning supplies just because sometimes their Lysol or like their Vim or Murphy's Oil is a better price than even Walmart, but it depends on the sizes. Oh, here's some new Dawn. But this is a little bit pricey. Four dollars for this bottle. You can oh goo on Murphy's oil. Murphy oil is not too bad. Two dollars and fifty cents. Gugon's a little bit pricey still too, because you can buy the tiny little bottles for one dollar at uh, Dollar Tree versus this giant bottle for four dollars. It goes a long way if you do need it. I typically use. You know what I like to use is orange oil or oil. Yeah orange oil removes all the stickies from things it's an essential oil almost I think is this the little um, spray bottle that the US ladies were finding I know it was a big item at the Dollar Tree there but I never did see them at ours, so I'm wondering if that's the same product here. Is it made by Love? I should ask them. Oh, who else loves? Is it Allium or Aliums? They're beautiful. I love them in the real gardens. Oh, 
Oh, I'm going to buy a pack for $2.50. They're the Jimbo ones. They're great for making roasted marshmallows over the campfire or even um, s'mores. I'm going to buy a pack of these cookies here. They already come with the chocolate and the cookie. So just squish them. I put them in foil and the kids can roast them over the fire. Yeah, I think I'll do that. A dollar for this pack is not too bad at all. And two fifty for the marshmallows is a fantastic buy, especially for these giant ones. Oh, these are mini. Otherwise, I'd buy the celebration cookies.
these are similar not identical of course but they are the little banks that you spot at Dollar Tree as well they don't have the puppy prints they're usually like a vacation fund or a save for shoes or something like that you go down this aisle oh yes do you guys remember last well this past Halloween I made my husband a jellyfish we're using the clear umbrellas from Dollarama <laughs> he was glowing around the neighborhood it was so cute I'm so sorry about George quit. Some awesome craft supplies here however I do prefer the 8x10 canvas boards from the Dollar Tree and the reason is because they're less expensive but also the wood is already exposed on the back so I mean these might be a little bit better quality however I do prefer the Dollar Tree ones tons of stickers here if you're needing letters butterflies oh my goodness sequins anything really they have a ton of craft supplies at Dollarama but you will find more craft supplies at other stores typically this one is a little bit smaller so and I head to the checkout I wanted to say thank you for joining me I hope that you enjoy walking through Dollarama with me today and finding some new items and until next time everyone have a wonderful day thank you so very much for watching I look forward to sharing the haul with you bye for now